Hi, my name is Daniel and today I'm going to be explaining the differences between the letters V and W. As you can see on the screen, they kind of look similar and in fact in French and German the letter W is actually double V. So we're going to be talking about the differences today and hopefully helping you to understand how to pronounce them and how to use them and recognize them. Um, we will start with the letter V. There are two stages. The first stage is, if you can see this character here, is to get your fangs ready like a vampire and put them over your bottom lip. That's the first thing we're going to do. Just like this. And then the second thing to remember when saying the letter V is we want to start with our mouth nice and big and wide. And we're going to finish nice and narrow. Remembering those fangs come over the bottom lip. Let's practice together. V. V. Now your turn. Good. Now I'm going to say each of the words up here and I would like you to repeat after me. Vex. Vain. Visit. Virus. Good. Now, the letter W. This is a little bit different. There are three stages. Stage one is to make your mouth nice and round like a wheel. Stage two is to wait a moment. So to hold in place your W shape like a wheel. And stage three to widen your mouth. Let's practice that together. What? What? Now you try. Let's practice these words together. Word. Weak. Wood. Wink. Very good. Now, English, of course, has exceptions. And in the case of W in written English, we have an exception when the letter R is after the letter W. What's this animal here? That's right, it's a dog. What sound does a dog make? Yes, that's right. And the way that you pronounce WR words is to say R, R, just like a dog. Let's look at each of these pictures in practice. Wrist, wrong, right. Very good. Now, to finish, we're going to practice each of these three sounds using a very simple game. I am going to say the name of a city in the world that begins with either the R, the V, or the W sound. And then I'm going to say another. And all you have to do is to tell me in which order um, I said them and follow the lines and tell me the color. Here's an example. If I say Rocklau and Vilnius, it gives the color blue. R followed by V. Here's the next example. Vienna is the first and Washington DC is the second city. Again, Vienna and Washington DC. What did you get? If you said yellow, well done. 
Good job. V for Vienna, followed by W for Washington, D.C. Thank you very much for listening today. I hope to see you again soon.